How's it going everybody? Welcome back for some more Terraria here on Nicely Done. I am Drew Nicely, and for today's episode, uh, completely didn't have anything really planned, but I know for a fact I want to get some new items. And we have a couple of places that we can definitely get some new items with. Um, so I'm thinking, instead of exploring the dungeon that we've done a couple of times, and we can go clean out when further necessary, or go back there when there are new things there. I'm thinking right now we could just head to hell. We could head down to the end of the world and use our magic carpet and like, oh geez, we got a full inventory. Hold on. <laughs> we got, let's see if we can craft up anything with um, the Deathbringer or with the, 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 the shadow stuff from last episode where we beat the Eater of Worlds. First try, no problems. <laughs> um, let us first put life crystal in there because we're going to use that to make um, heart pieces. I also have a, the nimble enchanted sword in here, or freaking heart, heart in a jar things. You know what I'm talking about. The life regeneration item you hang up, kind of like a campfire can't think of the name at the moment. Heart Lantern. Jeez. <laughs> um, let's put a couple things away to clean up our inventory a bit. Um, ba -ba -ba, what else? That'll go in there. And then living stuff can go in there. I don't know why my background flashes red like that occasionally. If you, if you guys know, well, that'd be that'd be lovely. If you guys know, to let me know. <laughs> uh, let's put the pho in here. I think that is sufficient enough room to be able to craft up something. Did I really just put the shadow scales? Over there. Did I? Did I read it? Shadow scales. <laughs> there they are. Um, what else did we need? Demonite. The demonite ore. How, how much demonite did we get? 94? Tain bad. Tain bad. Alright, let's craft up some demonite bars. And then, we'll see if we can make. Actually, we'll probably be able to make. We can make the Nightmare Pickaxe. And a Combined Hellstone. Awesome. Oh, so can the Deathbringer Pickaxe, which means we can make the Hellfire Pickaxe. Which means. We can make the Terra Blade. Hmm. That's a thought. 70% pickaxe power, so instead of making the Nightmare pickaxe, ours is actually currently better. So, with that, we have to make the Light's Bane, because that's one of the ingredients to the Terra Blade, as with uh, the Butcher's Blade, an Enchanted Sword, and... Um, the Hellstone. So let's actually go down to Hell, see if we can get some Hellstone for some Hellstone bars. See what we can craft up. I think uh, we need to go to a Demon Altar to craft up the Whatchahoosits for the, the, the Terror Blade. I'm not entirely sure. I can't remember. I remember we did it for like a special in Season 1. Crafted up the Terror Blade. Maybe we can do that today. It's only been f four minutes into the episode so far. And we're remembering all sorts of stuff. So, huh, we arrive in the underworld. Huh. Let's find us some Hillstone. Um, what's up, guys? Lava Slimes, buddies, how you doing? Um, 
Um, Hellstone, Hellstone. Uh, let's mine up some that won't kill me when I try to get it. <laughs> As if you remember, Hellstone, when you mine it, it re releases lava. When you break, <coughs> when you break a Hellstone ore, or majigs. Look at all that Hellstone right there. So, let's mine this from the bottom up. Might kill me in the process. Okay, so we just cleared out a little bit of space for an escape. Cool. So let's get relatively close here. Let's dig down this lava to relieve this. And then have an escape for the hellstone lava and we'll dig from the bottom up as to not destroy our hellstone in the process oh see we got to be careful right there um, bone serpent get out of my face you ain't welcome here brah huh. gonna eat my rain clouds <laughs> Let me try to scoot over a little bit. There we go. I want to try to get the hellstone to, or you want to mine it slow enough to where the lava doesn't destroy the hellstone when you mine it. Burning spheres, that's what it's attacking me. Sorry, I'm focusing real hard on this. I want to get as much hellstone as I can. Huh. Oh, lava's pouring on my face. Well, <laughs> we picked up some hellstone before I die. <laughs> Is that enough to do anything with? I doubt it because we need a lot. Um, where did I put those chains? Are the chain the chains are in? Should be in this chest. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Excuse me. Um, let's grab this thing and let's come up here. Make ourselves a heart lantern real quick. So we can regen a little bit faster. Still have some loot to put away, but that's fine. Um, put the lantern right there. See how many hellstone bars we can craft. Oh, you know what? We need the hellforge. Hellforge. Right? Why can't I craft my bars? Crimtain. Meteorite. That's why. Haha, -ha, we need obsidian. And lots of it. <laughs> totally spaced on the obsidian part of that equation. Um, where is the best source of obsidian? I think it's like right before we get to the, the full underworld. Um, let's see. Kind of just poke around, see where the lava was. Um, getting close. There's some water there we can kind of mine or release the water. Ooh, we also got water over here too. So let's mine up this obsidian. Release the water. Turn a bunch of this into. There we go. Just mining obsidian. <laughs> Don't mind me. Don't mind me. I'm mining obsidian. <laughs> Play on words, even though it's mined. 
Oh man, Riddler. <coughs> You're such a hoot. <laughs> oh jeez, oh jeez. Well, that's interesting. Huh. Okay. I'm going to burn a little bit. Or not. Just fly right on top of it. That's cool. Try to mine backwards without falling in lava. Try to get as many obsidian pieces as I can so I can craft up as many bars as I can. Okay, so let's head down a little bit farther. Meow. Don't know where I am. Where is I? Not too far. There's some platinum, I think. Not really needed at the moment, but okie dokie. Ah, here's some good sections. Get a couple of pieces. And get these couple of pieces. And then we'll unleash the torrent of water. Uh, can't see what I'm doing, so I'm just mining around. Cool. Alright, so let's unleash this water here. And carve into. Ooh, we got a depth meter from killing. Oh, geez. Uh, I'm still on fire. I don't know how we <laughs> how we got that death meter. I don't know what we just killed. Was it cave bat? Um, did not pay attention. So let's see if we can actually get some more obsidian. Um gonna have to go up a bit more I think there was a nice sized lake or something up here ah here we go look at all that water right there cool so we'll go dig this out a little bit so I can go down there go to the bottom mine sideways and then we'll rush over to that lava pool to get as much of that obsidian as possible. We got 81 pieces right now. Um, probably don't need more, but that's fine. We're gonna need it for other crafting recipes, I suppose. Come on, water. All right, cool. Now we could just mine, mine away at this obsidian or at this lava pit. Or not, because <laughs> the lava went down to hell, or went down to the underworld, or the water went down to the underworld instead of staying up here. So with that, I think 117 pieces should do fine for right now. What's up, Beetle? I don't need your dyes right now. Um, who we got an arc demon? Cool, cool story. I'm gonna fly away. Just leave me alone. <laughs> fly away, fly away. <clears throat> Probably actually need to go down a little bit more so we can get any possible chests, shadow chests. Sub Bone Serpent. Didn't I tell your buddy this before? Stay away from me. And I'm gonna burn a little bit. Ow, ow, ow. I'm on fire. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Totally gonna die. Couldn't put the fire out. True. Truth be that. So we have 28 hellstone. I'm pretty sure it's like three or four, maybe like seven. If it's seven, that'd be ridiculous. Ore pieces. The ore pieces. 
as well as, I think it's a one for one ratio. Oh, three to one. Okay, so three pieces of hillstone and one piece of obsidian to make a hillstone bar. My inventory is full. Do not need dirt. Do not need blinkers. I do not need ash or ice or cobwebs or another rain hat. Really don't need that. Cool story. All right, crafting up some hellstone bars. We made nine, and we need twenty to get the fiery great sword. All right, we got like four and a half minutes. Let's go get some more hellstone. We're gonna make this fiery sword, and then maybe between episodes, I'll make another one, and then I think we'll wrap up the, today's episode with the terror blade. That'd be legit. Oh, you know what? We didn't. I need to make one ingredient to the terror blade. I, I don't think it's the enchanted sword. I think we need to make. Or head to the jungle. So maybe the jungle will be next episode. I'll head there to get the ingredients for the the sword that you get from the jungle. Um, can't recall what it is. But it's a good sword and it's the one that we need to be able to complete the terror blade. If my facts serve me correct. Let's see. What's up, demon? Out of my face. Out of my face. <laughs> right, let's dig down. Uh, let's try to get the. That's a lot of hellstone right there. Um, let's make a path for the lava to disperse. And mine away. Oh. Oh, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die. I need potions. <laughs> I really should be using, like, the fire potions. The obsidian skin potions. Um, you know what, let's go back up top. I know I got one or two of those. This will make this whole ordeal way faster. So we're gonna make the fiery gray sword. And that's gonna be today's episode. The fiery freaking greatsword. <laughs> um, what did I come up here for? Obsidian skin, that's correct. Uh, gravitation potions, obsidian skin, here we go. Light's Bane is not better than the enchanted sword. Undoubtedly. Being at only 17. Attack power. The enchanted blade is at 23. Attack power. 29, because ours is demonic. Um, back down. <laughs> back down the rabbit hole, down into hell. Um, let's see. Once we actually cross the threshold into the underworld, I will pop our obsidian skin potion. Here we go. Blam. Cool. So now let's dig ourselves. Yeah. Look at all this. Now we can just stand in lava and not get hurt. Now the only thing we got to pay attention for is making sure that the hellstone doesn't burn up in the lava. And that we don't die to demons. <laughs> Or drown in, you can't drown in lava, it's not possible. <laughs> but we can get a crap ton of hellstone. This is a big old vein right here. I think this will get us enough for fiery greatsword. Swimming in lava, protected by arc demons. I'm not protected by arc demons. 
getting attacked by our arc demons. Swimming in lava. <laughs> getting attacked by arc demons. We're running up on 20 minutes here. So let's hurry things along. Mine up this hillstone. I was like, how did I get the on fire buff? Oh, we got hit by a demon. Or one of those, uh, the fire orbs. I'm really thankful you can't drown in lava. <laughs> Saves a lot of trouble. Um, we just got a hundred more pieces. That's four times as much as last time. This will definitely be enough. And maybe we can create the Hellstone armor as well. And then once we have the full Hellstone set, I don't know if I'll use the Hellstone set or the Crimson armor. I think I used the Crimson armor last time against the wall, uh, wall of Flesh. Um, maybe the Hellstone armor will give us better, or well, maybe will help us kill it faster. Who knows? We also need to make the Imp Staff. That'll give us our freaking first minion. Okay, do we have enough? 20, 17, we need 37 bars. Yay! We have 42 bars. We get to make the Fiery Great Sword, which is better than the current sword that we got. And we get to make... Ooh. Um... Hold on a sec. Hmm. Yeah, so since you know the scheme of what I'm going to do, I'm going to make the Molten Pickaxe. I'm going to go back down there and grab up that stuff. I might throw it in at the end of this episode. Um, just as like a little fast forward. But I want to make the Imp Staff for right now. Make sure I got that in my inventory. Because this is a really cool minion pet. <coughs> or minion, not a pet. And probably one of the most damaging minions... Um, we get to summon him and he fights for you. And he attacks stuff. He's not like your pet, which you can also have out, which I don't have on me at the moment. Um, ooh. Fire Grace for a slow speed. But look at that thing. That thing is monstrous. Let's go kill some stuff with it. And we'll call today's episode off. Um, <laughs> pretty darn productive episode. Didn't do what I thought I was going to do, which was explore hell for Drax, because that's what I wanted. Instead, we get to make a molten pickaxe <laughs> here in a moment. Smash that thing's face. Hey guys, sorry about the weird cut just then. Um, freaking last, what is it, six minutes of my episode got cut off. My phone, or my device stopped recording. My phone decided to stop recording at 23 minutes when I ended the episode at 29 minutes. But in any case, um, the last, after I was smashing zombies over there, uh, the only thing I really did was go down to hell. Um, I was going to put like a little montage, like a little speed up for like the last minute or so of me mining more hellstone. Um, but yeah, I just went down Mined a little bit more Hellstone, made the Molten Pickaxe, <clears throat> and had enough for a Molten Helmet left over. So, with that said, um, I don't think I'm going to be doing anything between episodes on this world. Wink, wink. Um, but yeah, I think... We're going to call it for today's episode. It's been a really productive episode. Um, made, or we didn't get what we needed to, or what I wanted to done, but we got a significant amount of other stuff done. Um, wanted to find a Drax and explore Shadow Chest, but instead, we crafted up fire and molten stuff. All right, we crafted up the Fiery Greatsword, the Fire Imp, or the Imp Staff, the Molten Pickaxe and a Molten Helmet. 
So I might go down and make the molten, or the rest of the molten armor. Um, might wait for you guys. I think I'm going to wait for you guys, probably till next episode, to make the molten armor. Make the rest of that. We'll go down there, make the molten armor, and then explore the rest of the health. Um, we're going to inevitably need to do that anyway, because we need to start the preparations for the Eater of Worlds battle, which entails exploring all of hell, or all of the underworld, all the way to the right side of the screen, where he shows up, and making a battleground, and hopefully being able to kill him before he gets over here to the guys. That would be annoying to have to respawn in all those guys. But yeah, that's going to do it for today's episode. If you guys liked the episode, if you guys liked what was, what was going on, like the items that we made, if you guys uh, enjoyed the episode, if it helped you chill out, helped you, helped you relax, if it got you amped up to play more games, hit that like button. Let me know down in the comments how my video made you feel. I love talking to you guys down in the comments. Um, also, so, future episodes, we got more builds, we got more boss battles, we're not going to hard mode yet, at least in the next 10 episodes at least, I'm going to try to slow things down a little bit, fighting all the bosses, <laughs> now we got items to explore, we have the jungle to explore, we have the, the queen bee to kill, we have queen bee items to get, we have the vine sword to make. Um, we have a bunch of stuff we still got to do in the jungle. So yeah, next episode I think we're going to go to the jungle. Or yeah, next episode we're going to go to the jungle like I was saying earlier. Instead of going to hell, we'll kind of push that off to the side um, so we can slow things down. <laughs> so next episode we're going to the jungle and we're going to explore that. Probably going to kill the queen bee in the process. So subscribe, stay tuned, hit the bell icon next to the subscribe button so you can get a notification of uh, when I post a new video. So you can be the first ones to check it out. So you don't have to wait until I share it to Google Plus or share it to Twitter or whatnot. You'll be the first ones to know. <laughs> it's pretty awesome. If you want to be even, if you want to know about the video even before that, follow me on Instagram. I post the thumbnail to the video hours before I post the video. Um, and yeah. Um, links are down in the description. Other than that, I'm going to stop rambling because I'm going to take another 10 minutes off y'all's day. <laughs> so anyway, see y'all in the comments and in the next video. Peace.